Fertility experts, some of them anyway, are now saying twins are not twice as nice. There's a recent push in reproductive medicine to limit the number of twin births in the United States. News Channel 5's Christina Noche with how one South Florida clinic is hoping some financial incentives will help. When Ruth Linder Jean and her husband Evans wanted a baby, Hi, NJ. Hey, baby. In vitro was their best option. Lots of tears <laughs> to get to this point. To ensure that they'd get pregnant, they asked their doctor, Scott Rosef, to help increase their chance of having a baby by implanting more than one embryo. I remember that day uh, where it's like, should we do one or two? One or two. <laughs> IVF costs about $15,000, and many couples are like the genes. With no help from insurance to pay that bill, they wanted to make sure their one shot at having a baby is a success. We want one healthy pregnancy, one healthy baby. That's the goal. He says the American Society of Reproductive Medicine is pushing doctors to limit multiples to decrease health care costs and the risk of complications. Do you have women come in and ask you for twins? Yes. And what do I tell them? We don't do that. The number of triplets and quadruplets born through artificial means went way down between 2000 and 2010, according to the CDC. But the rate of twins born has remained nearly the same level in the same time period, with only a slight decrease. Oscar Machado is the COO of the practice. He believes insurance companies need to be part of the solution. So he sent this letter asking insurance providers to extend coverage to more patients. We would guarantee a single embryo transfer on those patients that share the cost with the insurance company, 50-50. He says for the first time, insurance companies have agreed to at least talk about it. The genes took Dr. Rosef's advice. It is costly, but at the end, it's, you know, well worth it. And now, have baby Nehemiah. And we're enjoying every moment of it. Christina Noche, WPTV, News Channel 5. Some European countries that pay for fertility treatments require that only one embryo is used. Recent studies have shown that delivery rates are about the same if one or two are implanted.